What's going on guys? So today we're gonna take a look at the HTC M8 using the Chromecast to stream wireless from YouTube, another application. Let's go ahead and start right now. All right, friends, so, so we have right here the HTC M8. Beautiful phone, in my opinion, probably the best looking phone uh, today. This is the Verizon wireless uh, version. But basically, I mean, any Android phone uh, will work with this uh, application. As you guys can see, uh, I already found the application on the market Chromecast. So all you have to do from this point is uh, download the application. The application is free. And uh, once we access the application, I'll show you guys in a moment. It requires to connect to the Wi-Fi. So you're going to connect to the Wi-Fi. We are connecting to the Wi-Fi right now. I believe we are connected already. So right here you can click on it. Uh, you got four different, uh, one, two, three, four, five different uh, uh, options, I guess. Uh, you can click on these cover apps. And basically this is going to show you all the different applications that are available to work with uh, Chromecast. Uh, first one is uh, HPN, Netflix, HBO, Hulu Plus. You get Pandora, of course, uh, YouTube, Crackle. There are tons of different applications that they keep adding more and more. You get the Play Movies from the Google Play Store. So if you rent a movie, which I do all the time, uh, you can just connect this thing to the back of your TV and play the movie from your phone and watch a full 1080p movie. Uh, on your big screen TV playing from your phone. So pretty much your phone becomes uh, like a remote control. Uh, there's a Google Plus, so you can look at uh, uh, pictures from Google Plus on your big screen TV. So there are tons of different applications. There, uh, Red Bull TV is also really cool. They have a lot of different videos. There is a Vivo, Plex, they keep adding more and more applications all the time. Uh, so back to the main menu. And this is connect, trying to connect right now to the Chromecast. I don't have the Chromecast connected. So as you guys can see, I have the Chromecast right here. This is how the device looks like. Now let's put the phone aside for a moment and uh, let's focus on this up. As you guys can see, this is a very, very small device, very, very portable. Um, you can take this with you anywhere. If you go out of town, if you go on vacation, whatever, as soon as you have Wi-Fi, you can connect this to the, uh, the back of a, you know, a TV with a HDMI port. Most TVs now have a HDMI port uh, and basically connect to the Wi-Fi network and that's it. You can, you know, stream, uh, videos or you know use all the applications that i show you uh and watch them on a big screen tv uh the finish of this device kind of like a matte uh, black finish as you guys can see say chrome right there this is an led indicator this thing turns uh, blue when it's uh, connected and it's working and there is a, a mini usb port you basically connect uh, one of one end of the cable to this device and the other end to the outlet uh, for the electricity. And this is the box. HDMI plug-in, connect, watch. As far as the price on this device, uh, it's uh, $35, 100% uh, worth it. I use it all the time. And as you guys can see, they advertise right here some of the applications. Uh, what comes in the box is uh, basically just uh, the device itself. Uh, they include the cable for uh, the charger or the connector for the electricity. And this uh, HDMI uh, attachment or cable and of course uh, instructions. So why don't we go ahead and connect this uh, to the back of the TV and uh, go ahead and show you guys uh, how it works using our HTC M8 with the Chromecast application. Let's go ahead and do that right now. All right, guys, so now we're going to connect uh, the Chrome, uh, Chromecast device on the back of the TV and also to the uh, power cord. As you guys can see, here's uh, the power cord. 
So all we have to do is just uh, connect it right here. Now, as you guys can see, that uh, light is uh, turning red. Uh, once we connect this uh, to the TV, uh, it's gonna turn uh, blue. All right, now it's uh, connected. And from this point, all we have to do is just uh, switch the HDMI port to the right port. All right, guys, and now I switched the TV to the HDMI 2, which is uh, the port where I connected the Chromecast. Now I'm going to open the app right here. And as you guys can see, it's uh, showing here the name of uh, the device ready to cast. We're going to click right there. Uh, it's uh, connecting right now. And I'm already connected. So from this point, just to give you guys an example here, let's go ahead and open YouTube. And you're going to have to click on that icon right there, the cast icon. Uh, so let's uh, click right here on this uh, video. I'm not nervous when I go into games. I've always been a firm believer of the work you put in is the work you get out. And as you guys can see, it's going to start playing the video on the TV. And you're going to get the same quality that you get on the phone on the big screen TV. So, you know, if you're playing something in 480 or 720 or 1080, that's the same quality that you get on the phone you're going to get on the TV. And as you guys can see, the phone, the video on the phone is not moving, it's not playing, because uh, basically you're transferring the screen off your phone to the TV. And your phone basically is going to be like a remote control. Uh, you can uh, fast forward the video, you can go back, you can close it, you can open a different video. And let's go ahead and fast forward. Now that's as far as uh, YouTube. Uh, there are other applications that you can download uh, with uh, the Chromecast. If we click here on Discover Apps, there are all these uh, different applications. And uh, let's see if I can show you guys a different one. Let's uh, open here Red Bull TV and we're going to download it. All the videos here uh, in this application Red Bull TV are in uh, 1080p so you're going to get a really really good quality when you're watching these uh, videos here. Let's uh, start with this one right here. Click on cast here. And now the video gets transferred to the TV. Usually the first time it takes a few extra seconds to load and uh, there is a video getting ready on the TV. See if we can click on a different video. I'm really psyched on this bike park. Probably the cool And there you have it, that video is playing now on the TV uh, at full 1080p uh, resolution. And uh, this is just uh, one of the many applications, uh, like I said, that you can get from the uh, uh, Chromecast. 
uh, app, there are many different things that you can download and they keep adding more and more applications. Uh, like I said, very useful device if you want to watch movies or you want to watch uh, videos from YouTube or just uh, use any of these applications, uh, but you don't want to see it on the small screen of your phone. You can just watch it on the big screen TV. Uh, the Chromecast device uh, is usually about $35. It will work with any Android phone. I, be I believe it also works with an iPhone. Uh, so guys, uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Share the video if you like it. Again, this was a HTC M8 using Chromecast. We'll see you later.